Hi everyone, I am off topic from the beauty this week and bringing you a winter themed home haul. So around this time of year, every year, I like to bring out a few wintry things um, from my cupboards that I store away um, and add them to the home to give them more of a wintry and then towards the end of the month more Christmassy feel. Had a slight disaster this year and the space where I stored everything got flooded so in a, in a way good because I've got the excuse to go out and replenish my stocks and I'm sharing them with you today. Now I know it's only November and some of these things are very wintry, very Christmassy themed but in my opinion now is the best time to go out and buy it all because a lot of the good stuff starts to sell out sort of middle to end of November. So before I start rambling on for too much longer I'll start. This is a gorgeous little fluffy cushion. Um, it's a heart shape, it's grey, they call it mink, um, on the back it's not quite so fluffy um, and it's from BHS actually and BHS have really upped their game in the homeware I think anyway because to me it's not traditionally a place I'd think of to go and find some really lovely homeware stuff but they've got really good stuff in there um, and I think this was well, it retailed at £12, but it's in the sale at the moment for about £8.90, I think it was. And I've checked on the website, they've still got them. They've got them in white and they've got them in a lighter grey colour as well. And I just love them as a throw cushion on the bed. Speaking of which, the other thing I bought from BHS is on the bed behind me, but I'll show you a cutaway of it so you can see. I'm in love with these brushed cotton winter themed with animals scenes on them, um, bedding that they're doing this year. I know they're not going to be to everyone's taste but I love them. I saw the first set that I um, came across in Marks and Spencers and I fell in love with it but it was about £80. I've since realised that most places are bringing them out and I found this one in BHS for only £35 for a double. I really love it. Um, I love the reindeer and I love the brush cotton because it makes it so warm and so co so cosy. My cats have been loving it too. So if it's got the seal of approval from them then, it's, then I'm doing well um, and they also had it with polar bears as well if you're interested and definitely get on the website and order this soon if you want it because I went to two different BHS stores and they're completely sold out but I managed to find it online. And I can't do a homeware haul without featuring Primark. I managed to go in there with blinkers on and not look at any of the clothes because it would be far too tempting. And I got these little hanging decorations. They're too big for Christmas trees, but they're nice to hang around the home. You might be seeing them um, in my uh, video backgrounds coming more towards Christmas. So they're the wooden, um, sort of distressed looking white um, shapes. My description isn't very um, glamorous, but you know what I mean. Um, and I think these are really nice. These are the kind of things you see in Next Home for a lot, lot, lot more money. Um, this one was £2 for the little reindeer one. And then I've got a star one, which was even cheaper, £1.50. So I think they look really nice around the home. If you like to add some Christmassy or wintry decorations to your home without going for the full-on sort of red, green... Um, Christmassy theme then these are a really nice way to do it a bit more subtle a little bit more classy you might say not that I'm averse to a bit of tackiness now and then also in Primark I got this tea towel so I like to add a little touch of Christmas or winter to every room in my house and I normally do it with tea towels in the kitchen and this was a pound from Primark it's one of the really big tea towels um, so I'm gonna have to hold it right back and again it's <laughs> I must have been having a bit of a reindeer obsession because Again, it's got a reindeer on it. It says Merry Christmas. It's Rudolph with his red nose. Um, and I just thought that was really nice. Um, nice and Christmassy, but not too in your face to so hang, hang in the kitchen when it comes towards the end of um, November and December. I'll probably start using that. And for me, a winter and Christmassy themed haul is not complete without candles. And I go back to Yankee Candle every single time. I try loads of different candles. Um, but for me, Yankee Candles, for the price, um, give off the best scent, last really well. They don't burn the cleanest, but I'll forgive them for that. Got two Christmas themed candles, and this one is Snowflake Cookie, and this one is Candy Cane Lane. They are 7 99 in this size, and I often get the Christmas ones in this size, because I'm only gonna burn them for a few weeks. Um, and they're buy one, get one, half price in Clinton's at the moment. So, first one, the pink one, Snowflake Cookie. Really, really sweet. You, you're only gonna like this if you like sweet smells. It smells like, cookies as you'd imagine with the really sweet icing smell you can just imagine yourself in a um, kitchen with lots of Christmas cookies bacon a bit of cinnamon in there it's really lovely definitely only if you like the really really sweet scents this one is my favorite though the candy cane lane so this is is sweet but it's um toned down quite a lot by the smell of peppermint as in candy canes um 
It's different from any other candle I've ever smelled before and I love this one. I've been burning them both already. They both burn really lovely and both give off a gorgeous scent. Uh, one this size in a room the size that I'm in um, is fine so you don't have to worry about the fact because it's not really big and um, it's not going to give off just as good a scent because I find that they do. So I love Yankee Candles. They've got some really nice autumnal ones as well but I felt I was a bit late in the game to start to burn those ones so I'm going to go straight for my Christmas ones. And this is just an example of how you can Christmas fire your home on a complete budget it because this is something you would buy anyway but they bring them out in a Christmas theme um, and it's only it, it's only a silly little thing but I thought I'd include it and it's a box of Kleenex tissues um, part of their Christmas collection they've got quite a few different ones but I love the little Santa um, present style one and these are only a pound as well so if you want to um, Christmas fire your home as I've said without spending loads of money then little touches like this is the best way for me finally continuing with the reindeer theme I didn't realize everything was quite so reindeer oriented orientated oriented until I've gone through it now um, but this was one of the first things I picked up it was about two weeks ago but they still have it in there and it is from Wilkinson's and it costs five pounds and it's a little wooden tea light holder with two um, with space for two tea lights in there and they had these in three different colors actually they had these sort of, um, distressed wood color with reindeers on they had a a uh, mistletoe one and a Christmas tree one I think in green and red I can't remember but they've got a few different types and they're only a fiver um, and I think these look really good with tea lights in or the battery operated tea lights um, which I've been using in um, a lot of my tea light holders lately because they last longer and they are animal friendly as well because my cats tend to like to dip their hands in the tea lights but anyway so that I thought was really good for a fiver as well again it looks like something you might pick up in somewhere like um, next or John Lewis for a lot more money. So that brings us to the end of my winter themed homeware haul. I hope you've enjoyed it. I hope you've liked some of the bits you've seen and it's inspired you to Christmas fire your home as I like to call it. Give it a thumbs up if you've enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe. I upload every single week and I'll see you next time. Bye! Teeth in the world. However, I forgive it because the lasting power in this is phenomenal. The first time I ever wore it, which must be last winter yeah last 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 december actually the first time i ever wore it